Henry Moore, born July 30th, 1898 in Castleford, Yorkshire, England, was a renowned British sculptor whose innovative and monumental works transformed the field of modern sculpture. Moore's artistic vision and distinctive style combined organic forms with abstract elements, creating sculptures that embraced the natural world while pushing the boundaries of traditional sculpture. Moore's early artistic development was influenced by his experiences in the Yorkshire countryside, where he developed a deep appreciation for natural forms and landscapes. He studied at the Leeds School of Art and later at the Royal College of Art in London, where he honed his skills and explored various sculptural techniques. One of Moore's most recognizable themes was the human figure. He was fascinated by the human form and its relationship with the surrounding space. Moore's sculptures often depicted reclining figures, abstracted and simplified to emphasize their essential qualities. His figures exuded a sense of harmony, grace, and monumentality, while also conveying a profound connection to the earth and the passage of time. Moore's sculptures were primarily created using traditional materials such as stone, wood, and bronze. He had a deep understanding of these materials, and his mastery allowed him to manipulate and shape them with great skill. His works showcased a balance between solidity and void, with many sculptures featuring hollowed out spaces or pierced forms, creating a sense of lightness and openness within the overall composition. One of Moore's most celebrated sculptures is Reclining Figure, a recurring theme in his oeuvre. This series of sculptures explored the relationship between the figure and its environment, often blurring the boundaries between the human form and the natural world. Reclining figure sculptures were characterized by their smooth, curvilinear shapes, inviting viewers to interact with the sculpture from multiple angles and perspectives. Moore's artistic contributions extended beyond individual sculptures. He also created large-scale public works often placed in outdoor settings. These monumental sculptures, such as draped reclining figure and three-piece sculpture vertebrae, became iconic landmarks, transforming public spaces and engaging viewers on a grand scale. Moore's sculptures challenged the traditional notion of sculpture as an object to be observed from a distance, inviting viewers to explore and experience the artwork physically. Throughout his career, Moore received numerous awards and accolades for his contributions to the arts. He was appointed as a trustee of the Tate Gallery and the National Gallery in London, further solidifying his position as one of Britain's most esteemed artists. Moore's influence extended beyond the art world, and he played an active role in promoting public appreciation for sculpture through lectures, writings, and educational initiatives. Henry Moore's impact on the world of sculpture is immeasurable. His innovative approach, merging organic forms with abstraction, expanded the possibilities of sculptural expression. Moore's ability to evoke a sense of timelessness and universality in his works resonated with audiences worldwide, and his sculptures continue to inspire and captivate viewers to this day. His legacy as one of the most significant sculptors of the 20th century endures, and his contributions to the field remain a testament to his artistic genius.